all right what's up guys of course always welcome back to another wi-fi battle now before that battle is gonna head off i do want to share this team and uh, my thought behind it as it got suggested to me that somebody wanted to play the teams i'm using and i'm kind of felt the same way like why shouldn't i share them if they are viable for competitive play um this team much like every other team i ever use is not necessarily that competitive or viable but you know fun to use it's very straightforward we have two terrain sitters and uh, then we're clawless with terrain pulse to be able to capitalize on that and then we have uh, majin boo the wiggle tough with both expanding force and mystic explosion and it assault vest you pick your poison basically it's competitive and is absolutely going to use a lot of stuff um scissor i was able to cite the set i used before really good hits hard very tough to deal with and then we have uh, a shed skin sweeper of the santa Cana with call scale shots so there's earthquake and uh, it's not horrible <laughs> but it's clearly like there are room for improvement with the team as always but this is the team if you want to use it feel free to do so and with that said let's go into my battles all right what is up guys and of course always welcome back to another wife battle this time we're going up against damien and uh, the real pleasure is ready to see how this is go. A really dumb team, and um, yeah, we got absolutely destroyed by this. Uh, <laughs> love it. Um, actually, it's not half bad, but uh, there are some issues here. Um, I think Weezing looks alright. Um, Scyther also looks kind of alright. He does outspeed everything besides Gengar. Which I think is his best lead, right? Um, I'm gonna lead off with Gostel. Basically, if he decides to lead off with something like, uh, let's say, um, Zinray, that you'll be able to pressure that Pokemon. But overall, this looks to be like one of those teams that just beats me straight off the bat. I don't usually say that, but sometimes you just see the plethora that is OU and you just feel, yeah, this is gonna hurt. But it might be pleasant anyway because it might uh, my my intent and my purpose is to showcase good sets. He starts off with Inteleon. I think that's all right. He didn't have anything that necessarily resisted something like Dark Pulse, I believe, besides um, his um, Torkis. Uh, but other than that, I think Dark Pulse is rather free. Um, Aura Sphere has a risk of you know not being that connectable. So we'll see what he does. Go direct for Shadow Ball. It should do damage, but I think this Dark Pulse is going to absolutely sting him, but that special defense is going to force me out. Let's see what Dark Pulse does. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's, that's that's what we call a great lead. <laughs> Damn, Cole is just so underrated. <laughs> Alright, Sensing Gengar. Um, Alright, there is... There is no switching towards this. Um... I guess I can send in Jcomf and um, try to do something with that. Hopefully, right? Hope it goes for Shadow Ball. Let's see. What do you want to do? Shadow Ball, good. Got that one right. Um, he didn't have a dark type, did he? No, it's expanding force is kind of free. Let's do that. Finger Sludge Bomb against Destiny Bond. Sludge Wave is even worse. So he's not locked and this is going to absolutely sting. But I'm pretty sure Expanding Force takes him out, right? That's that's a no-go zone. Yeah, oh, it, oh. No. <laughs> okay. And I keep Sludge Waving, right? Switching to Reigns. I realize that this is not resisted, that I'm just being dumb, right? Probably not the best switch, actually, now I think about it. Ooh, yeah. That, that, that hurts. But... But... We're still good, right?
I should be able to take one at least of these. Gengar was trouble. Ah, nice. Ah, nice. Cool. Um, this was a great Gengar. It, it did absolutely what he wanted to do. And yeah, I'm paying a high price for that. Um, but, oh, poor Majin Buu. <laughs> That's how he falls. Let's see. Um, I think I can still fire off Gostel. We have Tokes and we have Hydreigon. I find I'll likely for Hydreigon to come in. So I think Tokes is rather safe for him and so is Cinderace. Hmm. He's really thinking about this too, so that's good. <sighs> like it gets the, like the worst of it all, right? I really hope he goes for Dragon Dance here. Please be greedy. So, because I'm gonna go for Drain Pulse on you. And you will not see it coming. Dragon Dance, Dragon Dance. Ooh. <laughs> oh, you're gonna get it. You're gonna get it so bad. You're gonna get it so bad, son. You're gonna get it. You're gonna, you're gonna absolutely die. Oh, <laughs> hell yes. <laughs> cool, it's the, this is this is why we do this. <laughs> oh man, that is some stuff, though. That is some stuff, right? Since you really have boom, at this point it doesn't matter. Um, not okay. It wasn't the real boom my farm was gonna be. Um, can I see it in my eclipse here? Um, I thought this really was going to be a grassy terrain variant. So we can easily take a knockoff or drum beating, I guess. Um, he will outspeed us next turn, though, so. Like, do I, do I switch out? Go for U turn. Try to get momentum out of that. Ah, I do the dual wing beat anyway. Um, he switches out, cool. To Cinderace. All right, so we're still in it. I actually think I am very capable of killing him. No, but darn if that wasn't close. <sighs> kinda wish, kinda wish it did better. Um, Still need this. All right, we'll do like that. Sack plane, since I am indeed is still like slower than anything besides toy case. Let's see, powerball, and we don't know, of course, whether or not this is. Um, Um, what would you say? It's a life orb. That's gonna be problematic, actually. Um, I'm gonna risk it with Gostel. It's at least, like, Clolis is rather, like, bulky. It's not super bulky, but it should be able to take one hit, I think. Unless it has, um... Well, you know, the obvious things here. Um, Dark Pulse is rather safe, right? Or as we are not, Frame Pulse. Let's do this. This is why we use him. Send him, but not Libero. That's good. <sighs> but if that was, yeah, yeah, all right. Got him. <laughs> right, Real Boom is gonna come back in. <sighs> right or Tokis, I guess. If Tokis comes in, like basically, I go for an attack anyway, right? He could be cheeky and go directly for a Dynamax here. Um, doesn't do that, that's good. Dazzling Lean will absolutely kill us. And, um, hmm. 
I mean, I really got no play here, right? This is... This is rough. Do I coil up, hoping I'm faster? I think I do that. Uh, I am faster at least, good. So... Air Slash. Okay, so flinches. And it does over half too, so that's really annoying. Uh, at least we will connect this Stone Edge. I think one call should be plenty, right? Come on. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Yo, 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 that's it, right? Now oh, we got this. We got this. We got this. And it's all about clawless that, that Hexress never saw it coming. <laughs> oh, it was cool. Damn, I, 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 just, I, like, I feel inherently this is why we play this game, right? Um, we scale shotting here, right? We're gonna get that speed boost. It's gonna be insignificant. It's gonna showcase we got it. You see this? This. This is what I wanted to do with Santa Conda. I got those five hits in. Oh, and that that provoked him somewhat? Uh, I think so. <laughs> Back to square one. Okay. Lose defense. Get speed. Will this set work? Who knows? This is the first time we tried. Earthquake. We could take those. Yeah. Yeah. Buddy. Buddy. Gonna get that crit then. Die! Okay, not nah, maybe not. <laughs> that was cool. That was real cool, though. Um, so this, this was an interesting battle. A bit surprised not to see Libero or either on uh, Rillaboom or Cinderace. But besides that, this was this was cool. So I'll stay safe here. Go for a U-turn, right? There's no reason of overdoing it. And uh, that's a wrap. So cool. GG is my opponent. Um, what else can I say? Like this team, like I said, has been so odd on the shaky side. But I think Damien really, really was playing for the win and did not know about the clawless uh, terrain pulses. And neither did I. That was, that was magnificent. This is why we play this game. Because of mods like that. You saw it there, it, just, it ruined him. I really hope that Wiggletuck would have ruined him too, but I'm fine with with Clawless cool showcasing what he's got because damn, does he got a lot. So with that, guys, as always, thank you for watching and have a great day. Take care, everyone.